Good morning, Dr. Eric here, Fanwood Back Flu Center. We're back in the office. It's Monday. Hopefully, everyone had a great uh, holiday weekend. It was restful for you. Uh, we're ready to see our patients again today. We're here from 9 to 12, 3 to 6. Just come on in or give us a call ahead. Today, we're going to talk about signs and symptoms you should not ignore following an auto accident. I don't know if more cars are on the road now, but we've been seeing over the past few weeks more and more people come in from auto accidents. Now, sometimes they're recent injuries, sometimes they're old injuries. But what you should never do is if you are in an auto accident, you definitely should get checked. Uh, even if you just have mild pain because uh, a problem could exist and your body could adapt and you could feel better after a few days, whether, we, whether with ice or medication or just rest. Um, but there could be an underlying problem that progressively can get worse and become a bigger problem over time and potentially haunt you for the rest of your life. So it's important that you do get your, uh, specifically your spine checked, your neck, uh, uh, and even your lower back too, depending upon the collision. But some of the signs and symptoms you should be aware of is obviously uh, any type of neck pain uh, or headaches can be an indication that you sustain whiplash injury. Whiplash is where you're the hit uh, from behind or a front end collision where your head snaps very uh, vigorously um, and causes damage to the soft tissues of the spine, which are the muscles, the tendons, the ligaments, and even nerves. You could also have damage to the spinal disc, the cushion between the bones or the bones themselves. So it's important that you get some x-rays um, of your neck specifically uh, and you're, if you're in this type of collision. Uh, obviously, if you have symptoms elsewhere, like your lower back, your mid back, your shoulder, whatever it is, your hips, you should also get those areas checked as well. We want to rule out any type of fracture or injury. Um, some of the s symptoms that are a red flag would be obviously dizziness, nausea, um, uh, forgetfulness, um, also pain down the arm, uh, numbness or tingling in the arm or hand or legs. These are signs and symptoms that something was severely injured. Uh, in any case, uh, following an auto accident, you should always get checked by your medical doctor, by a chiropractor, by a physical therapist, whatever it may be, uh, and I highly recommend x-rays uh, to rule out any type of trauma uh, sustained from the accident. A lot of times people come in um, and they have all these different types of health problems and I start going into their medical history and I find that they were in this big accident that, you know, kind of just, they were sore for a few days, but they did nothing about it. They never went to the hospital, never went to the doctor. Um, and it could be the culprit. It could be that, that that injury caused the spine to get damaged. And over time, maybe it's a smaller injury and it becomes a larger injury combined with other injuries. So very important guys, don't ignore those symptoms. Don't ignore those signs. If you are in an auto accident, please, uh, get checked immediately, whether it's a, my office or somebody else's, I highly recommend it. Uh, it'll save you a lot of problems down the road. Uh, any questions about this video or anything else on our website at fanwoodbackrelief.com, just give us a call. If you like the vi video, please click like, share it. I greatly appreciate your support. Uh, and I hope you have a wonderful day and we'll talk to you tomorrow. Have a great day, guys.